Good day, how's everyone doing? Uh, so this is going to be the third tutorial for command panels. Uh, so we're doing animations today, so you're going to be able to make an animation. So this is going to be just the regular version of command panels for animations. Uh, so, you know, version 3.x.x. Anything that's below that's not going to work, essentially. So, um, we're just going to create a new panel for animations. Um, so, I'm just going to use this chest. I've just put a, you know, a little bit of armor in there and covered it in uh, white stained glass. So, you can just do slash CPG. That's just to generate a new panel. Generate mode enabled and clicking the chest. So here's our new panel. Uh, panel 2 is the one that we just created. Let me just rename that. We'll just name it Mation. Okay, so I've just popped open the uh, animate panel now. I've given it a little name. Um, and so basically we want to create uh, animate value. And so I've got... Uh, here we are. So we've got 20 panes just in a circle here. So I just want to have like a little the blue uh, pane circling around just uh, in a loop basically. So since we have 20 of these, we are going to split the animation into 20 different sections. So I'm going to set uh, 20 there. So animate value is 20. If I set that to, you know, 9 for example, it's going to only come up to here, and then it's going to reset. Unless, of course, you skipped one every so often to actually get it all the way around. So since we've set that to 20, we can add, add an animate, and so that we'll add a zero so that this is the first frame of the animation. So we can choose a number from zero to 20, essentially, right here, in, but just behind the animate. So we can animate basically everything in this item. So I'll add in uh, that one there. And I'll make it light blue stained glass. And we'll name it. We'll give it animate frame just there. So now if we just reload the plugin and open the panel. You can see that there's animate frame and then it's just disappeared. So we want to add in all the other frames here. So I'm just going to go down to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So these are all going to start in the same frame. So we still have to put in these numbers so that they go to all the different frames. So if you do have the same number for two items, they'll just appear at the same time as you'd expect. And you can put these uh, animate values inside of has like a has perm sort of thing. So that you can only see the animation if you have permission for the item. Just put that in. I've set it to eight for now and I've just done the first eight items. Well, since there's an item named zero, the first nine items. So this will just be the first row. We've got the animate panel and it's just going through every single item just as that animate frame. That's essentially all it does is it just loops through over and over. So that's just going to go straight across, hit that one, hit that one and go straight across. So I'll, so I'll have to go uh, do the first nine. I'll have to skip through these. Just do this one here and I'll have to go in reverse and then I'll have to do this one at the very end so it actually does a circle if that's what I wanted. Um, so I will just add that in and get back at the end of the video. Alright so I've just finished all that and so there are 20 panes but I've made this 19 just because one of them counts as a zero. So 0 to 19 is 20, there's 20 values within that. So we've got 0 and then we go 0, 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 
8, stops there, and then we go in reverse for that bottom bit, 10, 11, 12, 13, and then we've got that 2, the 2 extra, we've got the 9 here, and we've got the, yeah, we've got the 19 just here, so when we, I'll just reload, so when we enter that in, you can see, so here's the little uh, blue glass that just pops along, just like that, all the way around. Just make sure that's all good. Yep, so that's perfect. What we will do next, I'll just show you this one here. So refresh delay. This is going to be, so this is kind of hooked in with animations as well. This is how quick you can animate. So if we set that to one, so four is one second. So this is going to be a quarter of a second right here. So if we just hit that, you see it's going to animate a lot quicker than it just was previously. Animate frame, so you can change the lore, the name, you can make it enchanted if you want to. Um, if you want, you can do a rainbow or something. Uh, you can have, you know, you can have uh, animate zero and you can have animate one. So here's the old animation update. 2.6.0 that was discontinued until this new one has been released it was um, you would use semicolon to actually write in so you do something like that to separate them so if you did that you'd have to go across to every item even if it was animated or not and add in so you'd have to have 20 of these in a row, just straight along the config for every item. Um, that's going to be basically it. See you guys in the next video. I'm not sure when that's going to come out, but see you then.